Hey, I'm making this video. Bernie is no longer going to be a P pump mechanical 24 valve. We are changing the whole setup. Uh, it still has the turbo 400 in it right now. Uh, but when everything's done, we will be going to a uh, 48 RE with the full manual valve body um, so that leads me to here is the donor motor uh, it's a 2004 59 common rail out of a 3500 series so I've uh, been working for a few days trying to delete all the wiring and get uh, build a standalone harness and you can see the wiring there that I've deleted the truck is on the ground basically I have a, a fast fuel pump hooked up a return fuel line a hot cable to the starter a ground uh, to the engine block and then I have literally You'll see one pink wire right there running back to the ECM and then one wire that will excite the starter. So basically, four wires total and I'm going to start this thing on the floor with the fuel pump engaged. The, ECM that's bolted to the block will excite the fuel pump when I power it up. I'm going to hand the phone off. So I'm hooking my, just hooking my ground up to the battery. And then I've just got one power wire that goes directly to the ECM. You hear the fuel pump kick in. And then I've got a wire that I just, I'm going to send power to and uh, the truck, the motor will start and should sit here and idle. basically one wire to the ECM on the block and uh, your hot wire to your starter and you know a couple grounds to the block and then one main ground to the block um, that's it and the ECM's grounded obviously to the block so pretty exciting basically made my own standalone harness the jumper cable I'm just using to for an extra ground so I don't have a grounding issue. That's all the jumper cable is for. See y'all later.